तत्पुषा विमे महादेवाय धीम तो रुद्र प्रचोदया ओं त्र्यंबक झमे सुगंधि पुष्टिवर्धनम उर्वाक बंदना मृत्योर्मुक्षी यमृता Chai Shri Krishna to all the devotees. My name is Radha Joshi, and today I am going to be telling you about a really important festiv festival called Maha Shivratri. But first, um, I say that I just want to say a big thank you to um, Shri Hindu Temple and Community Center and Hemang Bhai Bhai. and the festival i'm going to be talking about is called ram janma the birth of lord rama and now first let me tell you the story there was once a king called dashrath he had three wives and they were sumitra kaushalya and kekai unfortunately they had no sons so one day they went to dashrath's guru um and did a yagna to get sons and children so they did the yagna and out of the fire a bowl of kheer appeared and the guru advised dashrath to give the kheer to the three wives so he half the kheer and gave 50% to kaushalya and the remaining 50 he gave to sumitra and keke and eventually 9 months they had adorable children kaushalya gave birth to lord ram sumitra gave birth to lakshman and shatrughna and keke gave birth to bharat as they got older Lord Rama announced that treat everyone fairly and um don't be rude and follow our culture and religion but the main part here isn't that isn't the story i'm here to tell you about how it's going to help you in the future so first let me tell you what their names mean Kaushalya's name means the skin and someone that does their duty right sumitra's name means a good friend you can rely on them and kk's name means loyalty and empathy lakshman's name also means empathy lord rama's name means someone that you can rely on rely on you can trust them and Bharat's name means um someone there will be no enemies in your life and Shatrughna's name means that you won't run into any obstacles and now this will help you in your life because you can be like Dashrath and have self control Dashrath's name means 10 chariots the mind controls the 10 senses you use your nose to smell the prashadam your tongue to taste the prashadam your mouth to say the um spiritual names your ears to listen to the holy music your eyes to read um spiritual books your legs to walk to the temple and your hands to do religious activities so be like the shrut have self control and so show self discipline jai shri krishna jai shri ram